Okay, so uh, yeah, how about you just start by uh, introducing yourself and then kind of explaining what y'all have been doing over the last week. Okay, yeah, uh, my name is Philip Helbert. I'm one of the owners here um, at Helbert Barbecue. And so in the last week, we've uh, gone in, as soon as we got clearance from insurance companies, we got in and cleaned up whatever we could on the inside. Um, and then after that, we've just been working on getting this old trailer that was completely lost, um, just completely burned up. We got it started demo on it on Saturday. Um, so that's what we got all the equipment out and uh, most of the just like burnt stuff as we could, just torn apart just with, you know, what tools we had. And then yesterday I had a friend come out with a uh, cutting torch and, and just cut up kind of the frame of the trailer. And so now um, we've got a couple of roll off dumpsters that were loaned to us um, that we're just gonna try to get this cleared out of here. Hopefully get some fresh gravel out here soon and, and get it leveled out and get us ready to, to set up kind of a new um, a new system out here. Um, that'll be, you know, a, a, a dry, it'll include a, a drive-through barbecue trailer and then as well as a, a walk-up barbecue trailer. How would you explain real quick what kind of y'all's plans for the next few weeks and then kind of next few months? Yeah, so, you know, first things first, obviously we got to get this site, site cleaned up and looking a little better and, um, you know, the, the fundraising efforts have helped us being able to just like come together as a crew and and do this as a team, which is it's really special to me actually to, to be doing this alongside the people that we've been working with for the last several years instead of just hiring some company to come out here and do it. Um, you know, it's, it's personal to us. Um, so once we get this site cleared up, you know, we've, we've got a couple of trailers that have been loaned to us that um, we're getting them cleaned up and we're getting some repairs done on them and, and getting them inspected and permitted as well as um, getting some uh, portable bathrooms out here uh, and getting those connected into the plumbing uh, so that we can be um, you know up to code with the health department and then we'll be uh, trying to level out this parking lot so that it can um, you know get prepared to hopefully move a lot of traffic through here uh, in a, in a drive-through setup um, got some good friends that work for chick-fil-a they're gonna help us try to oh, site plan you know and and figure out the flow because who, who better right than chick-fil-a to help you plan a drive-through um, and and then we're doing some repairs to our smokehouse as well um, the burnt wood and screen that was lost uh, we'll be moving some plumbing in there uh, so that we can keep our three compartment sink and just keep everything, you know, up to code. We've had to pivot and get really creative and um, had, you know, a lot of friends and different pairs of eyes kind of look at this and, uh, and including the health department uh, to help us come up with a, with a solution for us to start slinging some cue again. Yeah, and then uh, how important has it been uh, for, you know, the community kind of coming together, rallying around y'all, you know, with the fundraiser and whatnot? I mean, literally none of this would be possible without it. You know, we'd, um, we'd have had to... Uh, lay off our entire staff um, and, and probably you know my wife and I look for work until we can wait on insurance to do their jobs you know we didn't have the kind of coverage to to um, you know continue to support the business while we're in this rebuild phase so um, they are the, the community and the way that God's working through people is what's filling that gap for us um, and, you know before we can hopefully um, you know, get money back for the trailer that was lost, and then I don't know, maybe buy one of these trailers that are that are being loaned to us. Uh, so, yeah, that's that's meant everything. I mean, it's the reason why Helbert Barbecue is still even a thing now. 